All right, welcome back to the Quick Speed Shop. What I got it going on tonight is I'm going to dig an old trailer out of my junk pile, and we're going to turn it into a wagon, a flat deck trailer with some benches on it to ride behind the doodle bug at the steam show. But what we got here is a good little old style frame and trailer. I like to find these. Usually people are junking them. I pick them up 50, 60 bucks and uh, strip them down. Some I save, some I just save the axles. But they're too cool to scrap, so I saved this one. It was all, it had sheet metal body on it that was all rotted out. I took that off. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to put a plywood floor on here. Then we're going to build some benches on the center of it so like six people can ride on it. So let's wheel this over. And uh, I got some reclaimed wood I got out of the dumpster at work. We're going to start making some per parts and pieces for it. I got my reclaimed plywood here. It's three quarter inch plywood. Um, it was a sign. It had a sign on it. It's all kind of weather checked and warped, but that's all right. It'll work good. It'll bolt right down to here. So I got to mark it off uh, 40 by 70. That's my dimension. So we're just going to give her a little cut. And the saw, which side is better? Probably cut the warp off this side. I'll go get the circular saw, we'll wing this out here. Alright, new plan here. I don't have enough width. You'd, you'd sit too tight. You'd, you'd be feet be hanging off here, so I don't have enough to go sideways. So we're going to have to sit facing forwards. And uh, probably, if I don't get the doodle bug running, which is in the other videos here, bink, I'll probably have to use a tow truck, which the boom is going to come out about 48 inches, which is about here. So I'm moving, I'm going to have two sets of seats. You can sit four on here now. First set, you're going to want to sit about back here. Your feet can ride, so you can fit two people easily wide, cut sideways, and get two more in the back. So we'll probably just ride like this, and uh, four people can ride on this, and it'll be behind the tow truck, and then you can look on either side, and you can get on and off, on and off easily. It's not going to be that far off the ground. So I think I'm going to go with two sets of seats and I'll make it a four seater here with some foot room about 28 inches between the seats. I have a faux pas. I'm out of screws inside. I thought I had some and I forgot to go to the store and get more. So I'll probably get this all laid out tonight. Then tomorrow morning I'll go to the store, I'll get some more screws and then we can put it all together. All right, it's the next day and I've come in the garage and I've made my steel straps for the seats. I'm gonna bolt on the surface like I described before. And I got these uh, dowel pins these from uh, doing concrete and we had a sidewalk that they tried to pick up and they bent all the rods over so I took four of them home and they turned out perfect for this this is the how the one was bent and it's going to be a perfect uh, side brace and uh, handle for the seat so I'm going to bend up the rest of them to match it and then this will be the side of your seat so right now I'm going to drill all the I'm drilling all the bolt holes to bolt the uh, 20 bolts down to the, to, to the plywood. Okay, so I got these pieces all uh, drilled and ground around the edges over a little bit. And uh, two little ones for the center of the seats. So now, like I said before, this is going to be the uh, the handle here in, in the, 
the side of the seat to keep you from sliding off it. So I got these two pins bent up already. They're bent the same. And I got two more that are partially bent. So just what I'm going to do here, they're all sticking out the same length. So they pretty much all got the same, uh, the bend starts right in the same spot. The right thing to do probably would be to uh, heat these up with a torch and bend it, but I don't have a torch. So I'm going to have to just muscle it with a piece of tubing. Ah. When we get down close enough. Should be getting close now. That'll work. We're not building a show trailer here. We're throwing together junk for the steam show just to ride around. So that one's close enough. Match her up. This one here. secret this is I've got the workbench I got a cleat when I built this wall I put a cleat in the wall and the workbench is mounted right in the wall so I can reef on it pretty good and not have a problem perfect so I'll just go ahead and I'll clean up where the mill scale came off here I'll clean these up with the grinder and we'll get out the welder and we'll weld these things up So you can hear, see here how the seat bracket's going to be. Have your bottom and your back, and then this will be our armrest. So if you're sitting in the seat, here you'll be sitting like this. You have a little handle to hang on to. Go ahead and get the other two welded up. All right, bam, here we go, look at this. First seat's done. Just uh, bolted the brackets on right through the plywood. And let's try it out. Man, look at this. Grilling and chilling. It's got plenty of plenty of support. When I bolt it down, you got the side piece here. It's a nice, nice, uh, nice height to lean on. This is pretty comfortable. But when we put it on the trailer, I'm just gonna have like a shipping blanket or something to sit on here so there'll be a little bit of padding. But I think this is coming out awesome. You got a little grab handle. Plenty of room for two people to sit side by side with plenty of room here between them nice and sturdy let's kick the other one out and then we'll go ahead and see how they're gonna mount up on the trailer hey look at that two sets of seats here look at this got my front seats I can put my feet here I think I'm gonna put a cooler up here in the front on the tongue so you can ride like this it's a little loosey-goosey I think but if we take it easy it should last all right I got my screws are a little short because I ran out of screws but I think it'll be all right as long as you don't horse on it too much. But it's nice and comfortable. I got my armrest. I can sit here, ride like this. I rounded the edges over with the sander here. Check out the back seat. Look at this. Plenty of leg room back here too. I'm grilling and chilling in the back. Check it out from the back side. I got my feet down here. I got a a crossboard to. To take the, the sideways motion out of the seats. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. We'll see how this does at the steam show behind the tow truck or the doodle bug. So hit the button over here. Bink. Please subscribe and I'll see you again at the quick speed shop.